Hey, what's up, YouTube? Uh, I wanted to talk about a plant real quick, and uh, you know, you gotta experiment to learn things. And I mean, sometimes you get failures, sometimes you get successes. So I mean, it just depends and varies on how you do things. Sometimes you learn a lot, sometimes you don't really learn anything, and you learn not to do that thing anymore. But uh, I wanted to talk about the ferns. Um, everybody talks about you know, like you know, just cleaning off a fern and it works. Um, as you can see down here, I have several. For, I have two ferns right there. I got a trident fern right there. I got another fern right there. I start off with one little tiny fern. The trident fern I actually bought, but I start off with one fern, and I'm gonna take a fern out of here and I want to show you something. Give me a second, just because I wanted to show people this because I thought it was the coolest thing I've ever done. I pulled off a leaf, a whole leaf, right? A full leaf. Um, and instead of actually just like pulling off the little chunks off of it, I pulled off the whole leaf and this is what happens. So if you wanted to grow like a big old mat of fern, you could see the root system growing on this thing. That's how you do it, is you pull off a whole leaf. I mean, I don't bury the whole thing, I just bury one end and then that's what happens. So I figured I'd make that video so you guys can see it. I'm trying to find the trident fern I did it to. Should be huge right now. But I've done it before and it seems to grow really well. So for you people that pull off and you want another plant, I'm looking for it. It might be on the other side. Is this it? Or is this a different one? This is it. This is my trident fern. I pulled out the whole leaf. You can still see the leaf. Let me zoom out. I'll pull it out. It's easier to probably look. The lighting's pretty intense in there. I pulled off the whole leaf. There's Java moss in there. Hold on a second. Okay, but I pulled off the whole leaf and I saw the babies on it and normally I pull off the babies and I was like I'm gonna try something different because my friend was doing it and he said it works really well. There it is. So this is a whole leaf, right? I pulled off the trident fern and I buried this back end right here in the middle and check out all the plants I'm getting off of this thing or the plant I'm getting off of it. Sorry, I'm trying to like do this one hand. Do you guys see that? Like it just grows and grows and grows and grows and grows. So if you want uh, another plant off of it, just pull off a full leaf. Here it is right here in the water. Pull off the whole leaf and you'll get a bunch of, not a bunch of babies, you'll just get one massive plant. But you guys see it? Hold on, it's right here. So just to give you guys an idea of how to, how to grow some ferns, uh, you know, that's how you learn how to do stuff is you try different things and you know, don't be afraid to try them. I don't have a towel. Great. Always have a towel in your fish room. But you know, um, so far I think everything's growing pretty good. Uh, you know, I do watch other people's videos and someone said to cut the corkscrew valves and uh, I've, I've just read so much on the corkscrews and I mean, I'm just leaving them grow. <laughs> But um, someone told me if you actually trim off the baby plants off of them, I don't know if this is a fact, so if someone knows, please comment below. Someone told me if you pull off the babies off of the, the runners off of the corkscrew valves, the plants will grow taller. So if that's a fact, someone please comment below if you've tried it. But, you know, that's a way to grow some uh, fern. And here's the other one. So just to let you guys know, I figured, you know, I learned it and... I figured I'd go ahead and post it. Here's one that I've actually done. I'll pull that one out so you guys can see the leaf that it used to be a full leaf and I buried it. So this is the stuff I tried and then half ass thought it worked. This is stuff that actually works, so here it is. This is this was one leaf at one point in time. So I mean that's how it works, so so you guys know that I ain't messing with you. It actually does work. It seems like the root systems grow better on it too. My tank's dirty. So sorry about that people. Look at all the duckweed that was stuck on that thing. So. Jeez. So that way you guys know that this thing actually does work. So I figured I'd go ahead and show you guys. And this tank is filthy. I need to clean this tank. So hope you guys enjoyed. Um, peace out. Sorry. Got a brain fart.